Who's got it better than us? Nobody! Nobody. Who's got it better than us? Boy Dino, aka the game. You know what time it is. It's Michigan football, the blog, coming to you live from the big house where we just survived another game against Army. Yeah, that's right. We survived the Army. I told everybody I don't our toughest game on the schedule. I was worried about Army. Proved me right. Took double overtime. Defense came up strong. Final stop. End of the game. What? Michigan 24, Army 21. Oh my gosh, I want to see Army again for another 50 years. Okay. You gotta hit that subscribe button. I'm giving away big, big giveaways at the 500 subscribers. So hit that subscribe button. Hit that like button. On that note, I'm gonna tell y'all again. Defense took care of business. The offense kind of shaky. Three turnovers. We need to have that worked out in this bye week next week because after that, it's only Wisconsin and the boys not having it at all. So let's get into the highlights of Michigan versus Army. September. September, September 7th, y'all know what time it is, let's go. Drive, Army, Michigan, here we go from Ann Arbor. And this one into the end zone for a touchback. And that'll bring out 15 yard gain, first down, Wolverines at the 28. Patterson again, under pressure, lost the ball. Loose. See, that's what I'm talking about, Shea Patterson. You can't be fumbling again on first down. You can't be doing that up in Wisconsin. Stripping it. Patterson, two fumbles last week. And it was a bit of a delayed blitz. Coming all the way around. Eric Smith loops around. Here he comes. Patterson, sloppy with the ball again. It hits the ground. Army football. McCoy in the backfield. They give it to him straight ahead. Touchdown, Black Knights. They capitalize off the turnover. Army marches it right down Michigan's throats. Ten play drive, covering 60 yards. Five minutes and 12 seconds, time of possession. Check out the left side of this offensive line. Jackson Deaton, Alex Herndon. Pow! That's some power football, man. Right in the teeth of the Wolverines from the one-yard line. So Colt. Charbonnet running it. Lowers his shoulder. Touchdown, Wolverines. So Jim Harbaugh fakes a punt. Gains 25 yards with Hill. And the Michigan Wolverines pay it off. Well, you're going to see a terrific block here from the tight end. Sean McCune comes in there, gets a terrific block, and is able to get in the end zone. And I got to tell you, Charbonnet, love what he does in the short yardage. Rings on Quentin Nordine to attempt the extra point. He lost the starting place kicking job to Jake Moody last season. And now they shoot. Here's a pitch. Loose ball. Can Michigan get it? They do. Picked up. Josh Metellus. And he'll get in. But it looks like they're going to down the football at the 21-yard line. Well, the pitch was just never caught on the outside by Kel Walker. Here's Hopkins. He's going to come out. Field. Here's the option pitch. Stumbled. And he During just never recovery, receives it. Had his knee on the ground. There's Metellus. Boy, I tell you what. It looked like he was trying to get up. Was he up by the time he actually grabbed the ball? Yes, he was. It looks like he was. This should be a touchdown for the Wolverines. Patterson to throw on first down. And he stripped. Lost it again. And Army recovers. Elijah Riley. The senior from Port Jefferson, New York. Shea Patterson has fumbled twice. And we have 10 seconds to go in the first quarter. Oh, 
This one, unfortunately, is not really Shea's fault. There was a blitz pickup issue on the outside. That's Elijah Riley, the corner. He came on a corner blitz. The back did not come out to pick him up. Christian Turner, who had his head caught inside. Look, Turner's looking inside. Riley gets the angle and backs it out of Shea Patterson's hands. So tough from a quarterback on that blind side, Gus. Nothing Patterson can do there. Excellent play from zero drops a year ago. Charbonnet around the corner this time. They'll actually make that bend summary. And the Wolverines fumble it again. Unbelievable. Three fumbles in the first half. Incredible. Ben Summerin is just trying to lower his Tying head and get field. extra yardage, kind of slams himself into the pile. Ball pops out, and Army again with the fumble recovery. Black Knight. Uh, 30 passes, 30 rushes, rather, no passes for Army. Hopkins with the quarterback sneak. Sure looked like he got in from our angle. And it looks like they're going to give it to him. Going on the field, touchdown. Touchdown, Army. Just got behind the wedge. A little help from his fullback, Connor Slumka. Certainly looked like he broke the plane to the goal line. And Slumka just kind of slams into the back of his quarterback, Kelvin Hopkins, and Army doing what Army does. Taking the Going lead the inside touchdown. of three minutes of the first review. half. 2017 got it away and wide right and that's the end of the first half and the cadets will take it as they march into the locker room with a 14 Hopkins Jr. under center fakes the pitch rolls throws giant giant mistake from Kelvin Hopkins they go for the pass trying to roll out to the right side and throw the ball deep into the end zone to a tight end Michigan defended it beautifully and Lavert Hill was there Lavert Hill dropped a sure interception last week against Middle Tennessee probably would have taken it back for six I mean it was right in his hands he also fumbled a punt today up inside the five yard line second and goal at the one Chardonnay again, touchdown Wolverines. Second touchdown of the day for freshman Zach Charbonnet. And with 2.24 to go in the third quarter, Michigan with a chance to level the game at 14. And how about that sequence? Army looks like they've got a chance to go up 21-7 on the road in the big house. They get the pick from Lavert Hill and they drive it all the way down the field some good execution from that offensive line and so let's just go have fun play our game and hope to be there right at the end they're right here Army sends it away Ronnie Bell fields it and he lost it loose and picked up by Metellus my goodness now a quick haven't seen Patterson run it as much in this game. They hand it off. Charbonnet is dropped for a loss. Jalen McClinton. Joe Stevenson. And Michigan turns it over on downs. They had a miscommunication up front. You've got Ronnie Bell, number eight and 73, the tackle knocking each other off missed assignment three defenders in the backfield Charbonnet didn't have a chance Four. Patterson gives it to his running back again and Zach Charbonnet picks up the first down down in two McCaffrey snaps it they hand it off Charbonnet no denied again on fourth down and Army will get the football back with 2.32 to go. 
unbelievable. And again, the blitz off the edge. A slow developing. Fourth down and one. The pitch. Hobbs. First down, Army. At the 40. Option. Hopkins, first down. Clock will stop. Momentarily with 40 seconds. And now Gus, that range. And he pushed it wide. We are heading for overtime in Ann Arbor. Sandy McCoy in the backfield. Hopkins turns it up. Hopkins dives. Touchdown, Army. Calvin Hopkins gives Army a 20 to 14 lead in front of General Williams in overtime. Here's that big set, extra offensive lineman in. They try to exploit the edge again, and they're able to get it. They sealed the edge, blocking down. Hopkins is able to get review. over there. Excellent block by number three, Sandon McCoy. And the quarterback and captain dives for the end zone. Black Knight. Patterson will throw, looking, drops it off. Caught. Guess who? Ronnie Bell. First down and goal at the three. The handoff. Look at Zach Charbonnet with his third touchdown of the game. I told y'all that boy was going to be a beast. His third of the day for the freshman. And he just hugs the block of his tight end, Nick Eubanks, who did a great job kind of mashing that all the way down to the right. And as he lunged for the end zone, here, third and ten of the 25, Patterson. Incomplete, and that brings up fourth and ten. And now. And it's good. 24 21. Six. Hopkins to throw. Hopkins stepped up. Set. Lost. Michigan has a football. What's up, Wolverine Nation? Time for another episode of Show and Tell. Anyway, on this Show and Tell, I got a little something, something for you. Mini Michigan replica helmet by Riddell. It's pretty nice. Just like the helmets they wear in the field, only a little bit smaller. Anyway, a lot of people like to use these to get autographs from coaches, players, me. I just like to keep adding Michigan stuff to my Michigan collection. It's pretty sweet. Take a nice closer look. Even got the little pads underneath. Like somebody has that small. But anyway, if you guys want to pick one of these up, I'll leave the description below on where you can pick it up. Mini Michigan Riddell Replica Helmet. And on that note, I'm going to let y'all know, don't forget to watch the game this Saturday up in Wisconsin. Michigan taking on them boys, the Badgers. I'm calling them right now. Michigan 24, Wisconsin 17. We gonna beat them, we gonna beat them, we gonna beat them. My next video, I'm giving y'all my four horsemen. That's right, my four horsemen. Michigan I got four horsemen. I'm gonna let y'all know who they are. Until then, stay true, go blue. I'm back to work.